welcome back. HelpMeRadWit.com bringing you videos right now about derivatives and chain rule. I have a couple of examples that I was looking in my book that I thought that were interesting to share. So that's what I'm going to do right away. Picking up the pace with the difficulty of the uh, previous examples, okay? They were already hard. I think we should cover a little bit of more broad examples, okay? And what we're going to do is that we're going to work with a logarithmic function, okay? So we have right here y equals logarithmic, natural logarithmic number of, where was it? Oh, here it is. And the cotangent of x squared. Okay? Again, nothing to be afraid of, just a bunch of ladders, just a bunch of weird things, but we're all used to it, okay? We know the derivative of cotangent, right? It's minus cotan a uh, minus uh, cosec square, and uh, the derivative for logarithmic, natural logarithmic is the inverse function, 1 over x. So, again, it's all about figuring out what's, um, what's wrong with the variable, who's what, what comes first, who's h, who's g, who's f, okay? And that's what we're going to do right now. I have a variable. It's called x, right here. What happens to it first? Well, I square it, right? What happens to it next? Well, then I calculate the cotangent of it, okay? What happens to it next? Well, after that's done, I do the logarithmic of it. Oh, okay, so that means that x squared is h, okay? That's the uh, first step. Second step, cotangent, that's g. And third step, you probably figured it by now, logarithmic. F. So what comes next? Simply follow the chain rule for composition of three functions that we have done so far successfully. Okay? So, y prime is going to be derivative of f. What is the derivative of a logarithmic function? 1 over the argument, okay? If y prime of logarithmic of x is 1 over the argument, okay? It's 1 over the argument. So if I have y prime equals logarithmic of whatever, then derivative of it is 1 over whatever, okay? It's the argument what we care about. I have to think about it that way, okay? It doesn't matter what x or whatever, the argument, okay? The derivative of logarithmic argument is 1 over the argument, okay? So, going back to our example, derivative of logarithmic of cotangent x squared is going to be 1 over the argument, cotangent x squared. Notice that I'm writing everything in blue because this is the derivative, this is the derivative of f, okay? This is this step, okay? Times intern derivative of g. What is the derivative of cotangent? Minus cosec squared. C is C, square, minus, parenthesis, so that it's no, no confusion, um, evaluated in H, in H is X squared. Okay? One more parenthesis. Times, intern derivative of h. What is the derivative of h? x squared, 2x. And there you go. All we have to do now is rearrange everything, and the problem will be solved. So we don't really need this 1 right here, because 1 times whatever is whatever, or whatever times 1 is whatever. So we can just clear this up and move this a little bit to the uh, 
left side of the screen, of the board. So all I'm going to do is erase the one and rearrange everything. Minus 1 times minus 2x is going to be minus 2x. So it's going to end up looking a little bit like this. Minus 2x. Coset of x squared. for the exercise. You can see that we're picking up the pace, right? We're doing it a little bit quicker. And that's the way you're going to be uh, doing them as long as you keep practicing, okay? Everything is going to flow naturally because you're going to see things very, very quick, very, very smoothly, okay? Again, F, G, and H. What did we do? Well, the derivative of F is 1 over the argument. Here it is. Times interim derivative of G minus cos x squared, here it is, evaluated in h squared, times h prime, or n to derivative, derivative of x squared, 2 x. And there it is, just like that, as simple as that, okay? So from this point and on, all you can do is just keep playing with the different functions and their arguments and their exponents, if they have any, radicals, negatives, it doesn't matter, you can just